everybody. Welcome back. Today is Friday for us and I did not film yesterday. That's why there was a break. I was going to, I had every intention in the world, but if you missed the last video I had posted, it was Layla's birthday and I was in the kitchen like almost the entire day. And then we had her, all her birthday shenanigans and people over and all kinds of stuff. And you know, the next day I was like exhausted from it. And I was like, mm, I ain't doing nothing. So I just kind of hung out. We didn't, I relaxed all day. I read a book and it was fabulous. So I took the day off and it wasn't planned, but it was needed and it was amazing. So that's why there was no video yesterday. But we're gonna film today. Um, and I made some sourdough pizza dough. So we have that sitting here rising for dinner tonight. So we're gonna have some pizza. Um, last night we had, I had no peak chicken and rice on the menu. I didn't even make it. I didn't feel like it. We just ended up having, um, what is that chicken called? The chicken with the mayonnaise and Parmesan cheese, mountain your mouth chicken. We had that and rice. But Gary and I were the only, well, me, Gary, and Everly were the only ones that ate that. I made chicken nuggets too because Layla can't have that. So, and I had just pulled out a small pack of chicken because I knew she couldn't have it. And I knew I was going to have to make something else. So I just made a small pack, just enough for us to eat. And then a little bit of leftovers. And Gary took those to lunch. And everybody else had chicken nuggets and rice and green beans. So dinner was easy last night. I have no leftovers, so I don't even know what we're going to have for lunch today. Um, so the kids really wanted some crepes for breakfast, but I, I was not in the mood to cook them again this morning because our power went out last night. Uh, we had some storms roll in and it woke me up at 12 something and then it didn't come back on until four. And if you're like me, you cannot sleep in complete silence. So I was up the whole time. I mean, it was so silent. I feel like I could hear every noise. I would hear the dog out in the living room licking. I mean, every little noise I could hear and it was keeping me awake and it was, Honestly, it was annoying me so bad. I was like, please don't go to sleep. Like, just go to sleep. But I couldn't. I cannot sleep without a fan. I just can't. I'm one of those people. So I know there's people out there that like, you cannot sleep without your fan on. It is so hard when the power goes out. So I feel you. It's hard. So I was up like so much last night um, that when they asked for crepes this morning or yesterday, I had every intention of making them this morning. And then I was just too tired. I was like, mm -mm. so I might make them for lunch today. Since now I'm like finally waking up. I had my coffee. I'm like more awake than I was at seven something this morning. So, um, I think I might make crepes for lunch so that they can have them. And it solves my lunch dilemma of what in the world am I going to make? So maybe we'll just do that. It sounds good. Um, so yeah, maybe we'll just do some crepes and something else along with it. We just did oatmeal this morning because mama was tired. It was just one of those days. So today is our last official day of break. We do have Saturday and Sunday, but we don't really count the weekends as break because it's the weekend. So it's our last day of our school break. We will have our weekends and then on Monday we will start school again. So yesterday I did print out some stuff that I needed for next week. Um, so we're kind of prepared there, but I still need to get all of their stuff together. Um, like I always do. So maybe I'll get that done today. I don't know. I need to get some food from downstairs for the upcoming week, things like that. I just don't know what I'm going to do today. I don't really have solid plans. I just know that between today and Monday, I have things to do, but I have Friday, Saturday, Sunday to get it done. So we'll see. Um, so we're going to go ahead and get some crepes going for lunch. So, uh, Wilder is not going to eat them. He's going to eat some leftover chicken nuggets from last night, but everybody else is going to eat them. So, um, I'm using the blender because it just blends up and then you just pour it out and make crepes. So here we go with the recipe. We're going to do half. Yeah. That looked, uh, when I went to move it, it looked like a lot more half a cup of water, half a cup of milk, half a teaspoon of salt two tablespoons of sugar. I need to get all these little basket thingies here I keep in the pantry refilled from downstairs. 
have no rice, lots of sugar missing. So you do two tablespoons of melted butter. I'm just gonna do maybe a little over one of melted coconut oil. One cup of flour. And three eggs. And then we're just gonna blend it up. Right, now we'll pour a little bit in and try to spread it around. So we'll just let this side cook for a minute. We flip, let it cook for about 30 seconds, pull it off. But when you put it on your plate, don't stack them. Like let them cool before you start stacking because otherwise they'll stick together. It's this. Yeah? Yeah. All right, so here's Everly's plate. She's the only plate I've made so far. I'm still making crepes, but she wanted some with some of this organic strawberry jam in one. And then she just wanted a plain one. There, there's nothing in there, but that's her plate. Miss Layla wants peanut butter on hers. She's my peanut butter lover. Okay. And here's Ashlyn. Is this all you're gonna eat? I'll probably come back for more. Ish. She said she just wants a plain one because she likes the taste of just the crepe itself. And then she's gonna come back and get more. She said probably it was strawberry jam. And then, um, this is Wilder's. I gotta get him some other stuff, but he needs ketchup and like a side or something. But this is his, these are warmed up. You ate yours already? You want some more? Two more, one more? Two. All right, so here's her second round. And now Ashton's back for more. She said this time she's just gonna grab two. <laughs> They're eating them faster than I can make them. They're standing here waiting in line for more. <laughs> I really just came flying in for more. And I was like, um, hang on, hang on guys, hang on. I can't not make them fast enough today. So far, Everly's had five. Ashlyn, how many have you had? Four. Water didn't need any and Layla's had one. So the girls are tearing them up. Look, Ashlyn's back for more. Mm -hmm. Wait. Okay, I was wrong. This is now her seventh. Wait, no. That's her sixth. Sixth? Six? Yeah. Sixth one. They're so yummy. <laughs> Is that good or you want more? No, this good. is my last one. That's good? Yeah. Yeah, I shouldn't like too much on there. No. Just enough. There you go. I just... All right, no. Ashlyn, Everly really gets the last one because she's full, so. Um, How many do you have, Ashlyn? Like six. Like six? Everly is on her eighth one, seventh one? I think so. Yeah, so Ashlyn said, Everly really can have the last one because they are full. She said, what is in these? I am full. So I have to say, I had really big dreams this week of doing a lot of things around the house. I didn't do any of them. None. Remember six weeks ago on our last break, I cleared out the whole house and had like 30 bags of things for donations and boxes and other things. I had plans on doing stuff like that, not clearing out the house because I just did that, but cleaning and organizing and getting my white, white shelves in there organized and just kind of going through clothes, switching clothes around for different seasons. Did nothing, did nothing. And I just started a new book, so, and I'm not mad about it. It's been so nice. So I just started Before We Were Yours. So if you've read that, let me know. So here's my lunch. I'm just gonna have some turkey, cheese, and crackers. I have to this, that. So I just went downstairs and refilled all my containers. We keep this, these kind of things, flour, rice. These are not elbow noodles. This is sugar. <laughs> this is an old container. I never switched the sticker. Um, but we keep all these in five gallon buckets downstairs. So I just go down there, refill them, bring it back up. And then while I was doing that, I saw these butter beans and I was like, yeah, we haven't had those in a while. So I brought these up too. Not that we're gonna have them tonight because it's not really a side for pizza, but also earlier I got all of the stuff that we're going to need from downstairs for the next week for the upcoming meals and boy is it a lot. Sometimes it's like this, sometimes it's only a few things, but this time for this upcoming week I need a lot of things. So we're going to have, I already read this I think last week I told you guys, but like our dinners, just a quick review is going to be burgers and fries, hamburger helper, like homemade hamburger helper, crunch wraps, KFC bowls, air fryer, chicken and rice. Um, air fryer chicken with rice and then easy chicken lemon. Oh, I never made a dinner for next Saturday. So I'll have to figure out a dinner too, but, um, 
yeah, those are our upcoming dinners and then lots of other foods. And then we just need a lot of like fill in little things like mayonnaise, ketchup, um, oats, things like that, that I have to bring up as well. And then like some bathroom things that we keep all the extra downstairs. It's just easier. We have no room to store things up here. So downstairs is like our store um, where we keep all of our extra everything and we just bring it up as we need it because we just don't have the space up here for any of it. Uh -oh. Look at these pigs. I just caught them. Look at them. Come on, boys. Hi, it's dinner time. Time to make up some pizza. Miss Ashland's going to do it for us so I don't have to. She's looking at me like I'm crazy. Yeah, it's you your are. week coming up to cook dinner. You are crazy. You're crazy. And it's your week to cook dinner this week. Um, okay. Will you at least um, put this in the sink for me? Yeah, I'll sit down the sink. Thank you. I need to get out the cheese and pepperoni. Pretend like you work in a pizzeria. Oh. No. You need help? Yeah, no. Okay. I'm doing it with this hand because my braces are. too with some pepperoni if you've never tried it like that you're missing out it's like a hawaiian pizza but pepperoni instead of ham and then some garlic salt and we're just gonna cook both these pizzas up and that is friday night dinner all right pizzas are done you know what time it is it's time to end our, vid end our video Thank you guys so much for watching. Everybody just said that was the best pizza I've ever made. And what's funny is it's the same pizza I make every single time, but apparently today it was the best pizza. So there we go. That's a win. Um, you guys, I will see you tomorrow with another video. Bye. Bye.